As you all know, Free Fire no longer officially supports Android 4. This means that if you have an emulator that runs on Android 4 or below, only then can you play Free Fire on your PC. This breaking news might be heartbreaking for those who want to play Free Fire on their low-end PCs. However, there is no need to worry because in today's video, I will provide you with an emulator that is not only based on Android 5 but will also demonstrate running Free Fire on it. Ideally, this emulator is recommended for 4GB RAM but you can run it on 2GB RAM with low settings and don't worry about the graphics card because the emulator can run without it. So let's start the video. So I have now come to my PC screen. First, let me show you the specifications of my PC so that all your doubts regarding the system requirements can be cleared. As you can see, my PC has only 2 GB of RAM and a 2.40 GHz processor. Now let me show you the graphics card. Here, my PC has a 64 MB Intel HD graphics card, which is in very capable. Now let's move on to the installation process. The download link for this file will be available in the description below. You just need to right click on this file and extract it. After extraction, go to this folder and launch the setup. As soon as you launch the setup, you will see an interface like this within a few seconds. Now you need to click on this button and your installation will start. It will take 5 to 10 minutes to complete. So let's wait for a while. 2000 years later. After the installation is complete, a pop-up will appear and you simply need to close that pop-up. Now, let's quickly launch the emulator. As you can see, the emulator has successfully launched. Now we need to configure some settings inside this emulator. So let's quickly go through them. First, click on the settings button. Then go to this tab. Here you need to set the PUC core to the maximum and select 1500 MB RAM. After that, restart the emulator. Now my emulator has successfully launched and I have also installed Free Fire. Before we dive into the gameplay of Free Fire, let me show you the Android version of this emulator. As you can all see, this emulator is running on Android 5. You might notice a slight lag and that's because I'm using a screen recorder. So let's test Free Fire now. As you can all see, Free Fire is running quite smoothly and I'm not experiencing any lag at all. Let me know in the comments how you find this emulator. If you encounter any issues or errors, I recommend trying a low-end Android operating system instead of an Android emulator. If you're interested in a tutorial, click on the video that appears on the screen and I'll see you there.